Hi there, Layla here, and I want to talk about you if while I'm fighting through the snow on the school run, which is absolutely amazing. I'm absolutely loving it right now. It is fabulous. I wanted to talk to you about soggy ground and how Jesus can actually change what we're doing. Right, when I was walking, I was walking to the post office, I'd done a video about that and then actually I was quite ashamed of myself, I actually deleted it because I'm really embarrassed because I have what I consider coffee teeth. So I wanted to share with you to get over the fact that sometimes when my videos I really do panic that my teeth do look yellow and I just wanted to get it out there because by the time I've got it out there it's gone and it's not going to matter anymore. So I've got over that. And what it was, was um, I was actually walking in an area where we shouldn't be walking. Ooh, slipping up. I'll still post it if I slip over. Lord, there we go. Just so the devil can't tempt me not to post this video as well. If I slip over, I will keep filming. And even if I get notifications, I will still keep filming. And what it was, was I was wanting to say how God really put onto my heart the fact that when we're actually walking, it was like when I was walking, I was walking in an area that was really soggy and boggy. Usually I would not have gone anywhere near that in shoes. And I thought, oh, well, I'll just do the shortcut. And I actually went onto the shortcut and then I actually realized the shortcut, it's, it's frozen ground. I'm actually walking in an area where I shouldn't be able to go and I was thinking God is like that frozen ground he is there he is supporting us when we know we're doing wrong he is actually there supporting what we do so I suppose it was to say even though when we are doing wrong as walkers of believers we are actually protected we were protected the moment that we were saved we were protected the moment before we were born, before we even knew anything. Because Jesus has already made that sacrifice for us in the all-knowing of what that means for us. And I want to encourage people that if you do go in a place where you know that you really shouldn't be going, God's already there supporting you. It is so easy to just get back and just move aside and just move to where you should be in the path and hopefully this snow continues because this is absolutely awesome and I am loving it and if anything comes up like you know how I said about my teeth um, I do drink too much coffee I drink decaffeinated now completely decaffeinated but sometimes what will happen is the devil will he will go out of his way to push things into your mind so you're actually thinking of it. And a pastor that I really do respect had actually reminded us, don't stick into where you are. Don't be stationary. I have a fear about that. So if I move out of that fear, that fear, the devil can't use that against us anymore. So take care and I really do hope this weather stays and you take care and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.